All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashim Yahusha, Bahashim Kal Kadash. Double double honors to the apostles and the elders, the great millstone, the Ruel, and the salute and the Shalom to all the Akim that's out here laboring and pushing his truth in all sincerity and in truth. All right, uh, back with another uh, quick lesson, man. Um, I'm not sure of the title yet, but Jake, this is not the time to be afraid, man. This is not the time to be afraid, man. Okay? Because Yahweh Shah did not give us the spirit of fear, right? But gave us the spirit of power and of a sound mind. Let me get that. What's going on, man? Okay. Right, this is um Second Timothy one and seven it says For Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah hath not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. All right, man? Now now a sound mind is a healthy mind, right? Let's see, sound mind. Strong's G, 4995, Sofranismas. Sofranismas. See? Yeah. See, it says, uh, for uh, Sofranismas is discipline, self-control, sound mind. Right? Sorry, let's get self-control real quick. Self-control, self-discipline, right? Self-control, the ability to control oneself in particular one's emotions and desires or the expressions of them in one's behavior, especially in difficult situations, right? So we will be coming into some difficult situations, man. All right, Jake? And you have to have some... And you have to have self-control, man. You must have a sound mind, man, to be able to deal with the difficult times that's coming ahead, okay? Hold on. Let's see. Cross references, right? Let's get a uh... mm. okay. This is um. Acts 20 and 24, it says, but none of those, like it says, but none of these things move me, neither I count my life dear unto me, so that I might finish my course with with joy in the ministry which I have received of the Lord Yahweh Shai, to testify the gospel of the grace of Yahweh, right? So, so this is about having a sound mind, man, right? All right, man. You not, you not, uh, you not, uh, um, uh, you know, uh, uh, giving up when times get hard, when times get tough. Okay. This is this is uh Romans eight and fifteen, for you know not. It's like it's like it says, for ye have received not the spirit of bondage again to fear, but ye have received the spirit of adoption, 
whereby we cry selakia whereby we mm, selakia whereby we cry our father right so when times get tough man all we have have to do is call upon you how is is to call upon you how about man by what man praying man right saying Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh to give me strength to be able to get through this, right? All right. Now it says what? Let's get Isaiah thirty three and six. Uh no. Isaiah 33 and 6 it says in wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times and strength of salvation the fear of Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh is his treasure right so wisdom and knowledge is going to be your defense in that day Jake right your art right, man uh, uh, this wisdom and knowledge and understanding is going to be your defense in that day in these in in these days to come <sighs> Ecclesiastes 7 and 12 says for wisdom is a defense and money is a defense but the excellency of knowledge is that wisdom giveth life to them that have it okay so wisdom is a better and a stronger defense than money Right man, it'd be, it'd be, right man, because uh, because having money, right, uh, um, it won't do you no good in uh, uh, um, in the days to come, man. All right, man, because money runs out. Wisdom doesn't, man. Wisdom is permanent, man. All right. So this is not the time to be afraid, man. This is the time to be happy, man. Why, man? Because this is what we've been, been, been prophesying about, man, for years, man. This is what we've been waiting on, man. All right. This is what we've been. This is what. This is what we've been. We've been waiting on, man. Let's get Habakkuk real quick. Habakkuk two and one. It says, "I will stand upon my watch." And set me upon the tower and will watch to see what he will say unto me and what shall I, and what I shall answer when I am reproved. Right? It says, and Yahweh answered and said, it's like it. Khan says, and Yahweh answered me and said, Write the vision and make it plain upon tables. That he may understand Slakia. Like Khan says, says uh that he may run that readeth it. May what man may understand it. Says, for the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it, because it will surely come, it will not tarry. Right? So, this is what we've been waiting on, man. This is what we've been, we've, the, this is what, what we've been dreaming about. We've been prophesying about this, man. We, we've been having visions about this, man. Okay? So, Yahweh, so Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shah is speeding up time, man. Right? Jake, only fear Yahweh and Yahweh Shah. Okay? Now, uh, of course, we are in this flesh. Right? So, uh, so uh, of course, there's going to be times where 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 we are afraid right but the wisdom knowledge and understanding is going to kick in man right and that's going to keep you self-controlled man right man that's going to keep you self-disciplined man okay
is um Habakkuk 2 and 4 it says behold his soul which is lifted up is not upright in him and who is that that is Esau Edom man right it says it says uh, it says but the just shall live by his faith right now the just is the elect of the nation of Israel right let's get this Matthew 6 and 30 it says wherefore if Yahweh so clothed the grass of the field which is Salakia, which which today is and tomorrow is cast into the oven. Shall he not much more clothe you, O ye of little faith? Right? So, O ye, Khan says, all right, man, so, O ye of little faith, man, Yahweh, Bahash, man, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, the goddess, man, we have nothing to worry about, man. We have nothing. We have nothing to. I can. We have nothing to worry about, man. Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah is with us, man. You have to believe that. Let's get this, uh, let's see. Okay. This is uh, Hebrews 10 and 38. It says, Now the just shall live by faith, but if any man draw back, my soul shall have no pleasure in him, right? So, Jake, don't draw back, man. Keep the faith, man. Keep the faith, man. Stay, stay, const stay constantly praying, man. Keep on praying, right? And have faith, man. It says, now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen, right? So, this is what we've been hoping for, man, right? And it's coming to pass. So, Jake, that should strengthen your faith, man, that much more. All right? Let's see. Get this. this this is uh Hebrews eleven and twenty-five it says Well, I started twenty four it says by faith Moses when he was come to years refused to be called the son of Pharaoh's daughter, choosing rather to suffer affliction with the people of Yahweh than to enjoy the pleasures of sin for a season. Right? So Moses he had the faith to to let go of that sinful life that he was once uh, living in Egypt when he was in uh, Pharaoh's court, right? All right, man. So he so he had faith. So he had enough faith to leave that. All right, man, uh, 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 and to suffer with his people, man. Because Moses, he knew that that a great blessing was coming after that affliction, man. Okay. And on top of that, uh, uh, um, um, uh, Abraham, man, All right, man, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, Abraham, he, he uh. He searched, uh, he searched and had faith in the kingdom. Let's see if I can find that. Let's 
see which one it is. Which one is it? Uh, Khan, this is um, Hebrews 11 and 9. It says, by faith, he, he sojourned in the land of promise. And this is Abraham. As in a strange country, dwelling in tabernacles with Isaac and Jacob, the heirs with him of the same promise. For he looked for a city which, which hath foundations, whose builder and maker is Yahweh by Hashem Yahushah. Right? So, 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 so Abraham, man, he, he looked for the kingdom, man. He looked for the kingdom, man. Okay? He looked for the kingdom. Right? So, Jake, seek ye first the kingdom of Yahweh by Shemel Shah. And all these things shall be added unto you, man. Okay? Have faith, man. Keep going, man. Right? This is our, our labor of love, right? This is um, First Thessalonians one and three. Kind of says uh, we, but I saw the two. We give thanks to Yahweh always before you all, making mention of you in our prayers, remembering without ceasing from. Kind of says uh, remembering without ceasing your work of faith and labor of love and patience of hope in our Lord Yahweh Mashiach in the sight of Yahweh and our Father, right? So Jay, this is our labor of love, man. All right, man, have patience, have faith and hope in our big brother, man. In our in our big brother, man, Yahweh Bashem. Huh? Uh, Alright, man, in our big brother, Yahweh Shah, man. Have faith in Yahweh Shah, man. Because he's the one that's going to get us. Because he's the one that's going to get us up out of here, man. Alright. Let's go back. Verse Khan. This is uh, Hebrews 6 and 10. It says, For Yahweh is not unrighteous to forget our work. And, and labor of love, which he, sh which he, slack it, which which slack it, which ye have shewed toward his name, and that ye have ministered to the saints and do minister, right? So, Jake, this is our labor of love, man. All right, and Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh won't won't forget that, man. This is this is our labor of love, man. We doing this because we love, but we fear. Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah, man. Right, man? Fear comes first, man. So this is a labor of fear and of love, man. Right? So with that, I say, Shalom.